hello libra welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are doing well so libra let's see what messages come out for you guys let's see what's going on for you guys this week ahead let's see how my libra's week gonna be looking for libra what's going on for my libra's holy spirit what's the message for libra so we have a mature male and main female okay 25 could be significant or 52 uh oh hold on my little fat stand holders, okay. <laughs> All right, let's see. All right. So we got a mature male here. Somebody could be at a distance, this mature male. Okay. Wrong cards. So this mature male could be at a distance from you. This person doesn't have to be in your actual, wow. Yeah, he obviously is right there. You don't see him. <laughs> Cause the cards is right there and you didn't see it, okay? Or this mature male may feel like they don't, you don't notice them. Yeah, all right. Somebody could be at a distance though. Maybe they want your attention here, all right? Or you're not seeing something. Somebody want to give you the world is what I'm hearing. Okay. Say that Libra. So yeah. Okay. So it could be a high priest or a high priestess. Choice and love. Somebody wants you to choose them. All right. Yeah. They will be so hurt if you withdraw from them. Okay. So somebody has their eyes on you. All right. Mature male is a high priest. Okay. Or high priestess. Leader of a cult, okay? Hmm, let's talk about it. Who is this? New phone, who this? Somebody might want your number. Let's see. Wow. Spent on it. Okay. Well, so this a cult leader that's at a distance. Maybe calling for help here. There's some unexpected ending or a sudden shift. Alright, that has happened. Okay. Um, something unexpectedly ended. They might need help. Call for backup, admitting your needs. Okay, so this person needs help. Something's not working. Okay, Libra. Yeah, cycle has ended here. Earth energy, moon energy. So the cycle is over. It's been grounded here. Somebody's been awakened to that. That something has shifted. So they're calling for help. Oh, boy. Let's see. I'm hearing that's impossible. Somebody's saying that to them. Whoever they're talking to, they're feeling like it was impossible for that to happen. Hey, yeah. Well, your ancestor said, uh, remember, uh, I'm in charge of this. Uh, yeah. So that's what they, they, whatever they feel like was impossible. They need to understand that you have very powerful ancestors. Okay. So this ain't that. Yeah. You have the power of alchemy as well. Yeah, somebody definitely was maybe and on ball team was trying to hex your foundation and your money, your stability, but somehow it got balanced out. Yeah, because spirit loves you. You have the heart of a spirit guide or the heart of spirit, whatever. Homecoming, boundaries, protection. Yeah, so something is now protected. They like how? Somebody did a lot of work on this. Somebody could be working on that for five, five months, five weeks, five years. So this is how, yeah, Storm Angel to these, wow, 34, 35. So yeah, 30, something is going backwards for somebody. Yeah, they're trying to find a clear solution on how to do something here or something was simple for you to change something. They want to know how the hell did you do that? Because they was expecting something to end. Yeah, but you eclipsed. Look, it was the eclipse, a powerful shift of whatever it is. Somebody that was overdoing their boundaries or whatever. They've been eclipsed out here from uh, stalking you or, yeah, invading your space or your boundaries here. That's been eclipsed out. So that's what somebody needs to understand. You have very powerful ancestors. Yeah. Because the, fairy, the, the natural world needs you. This earth needs you. They need you here. You have a purpose, a very divine purpose. 
So whatever they were trying to do, it just no. They, they, yeah, they got to know from your ancestors. Let's get one. Yeah, black cat energy. You have a lot of luck. Oh, somebody looking at it as luck. No, you're just blessed. Because they got you on your on the altar, honey. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they do a lot of things under the dark moon on the altar with you involved, Libra. Okay. Yeah, but I feel like you're seeing through the fog. You can see clearly now. You can see through the dark moon. So even if they're doing things in the, under the dark moon or whatever, under the dark moon, under the new moon, you still can see through the fog. All right. Somebody was trying to cloud your judgment as well. <laughs> Good luck with that. The Libra? Nah, I don't think they can do that to Libras. Nah, not right now. It's not. That's not it. Especially if you're growing, healing, and evolving. You're a part of my tribe. You're growing. You're doing the work every single day to heal yourself. Yes, yeah, somebody definitely did a containment spell or had you in a cauldron, honey. They thought something was sweet. It says sweet. Uh, with this pumpkin, and sweet energy here. It says great uh, greeting in the darkness on the altar. What they got greeted with was the witch. Yeah, and this banshee is using their intuition here. That uh, maybe they could have uh, sent uh, used some sort of witchery to send a banshee away, but you were able to contain that that banshee, okay? Whatever demon they sent to you, you were able to stop the demon or whatever, whatever they was conjuring. Yeah, that's like wow. Somebody's shocked at this. Who the fuck are you? That's what they asking. Yeah, how did you control my demon, this banshee? They sent a banshee. How? How did you know about my demon? This banshee, they want to know how the fuck did you know what, what to do to eclipse this energy out? Because this person is supposed to be a higher, a high, po powerful high priestess, supposedly. Allegedly, I mean, I'm sure he is. If that's what they was doing, you know, that's his living. I feel like that's what he do for a living, this older gentleman. I'm sure he is. He has a lot of knowledge. Yep, whoever he is, he is powerful. Yeah, but the thing is, who you are, you're a natural spirit. You're very wise. You have natural spirit, owls, animals, okay, the fairy world, yeah, 60, 60, I was about to say 67, so 67 could be significant here, but uh, 26 to uh, 27, you have a lot of natural spirits around you here, mm-hmm, yeah, so the coming of winter here, you got the veil here, so you was able to see something in what they did in the winter time around Halloween, all Hallows Eve, somebody was doing some sort of work on you. Yeah, they could have conjured up a, uh, oh, a dedo. We talked about the dedo. And you were able to get rid of the, de the dedo. Yeah, they was hoping they could still keep that going this winter. Say that. Literally. Is you hearing me? Okay, I mean, listen. What he, you heard what he said, Libra. He said, listen, I got something to lose. He said, listen, I listen. You got something to lose, okay? Because you're very uh divine being. Okay. Wow. No extortions. I ain't talking about literally. You be walking on beats as you hearing them. So something you do, you walk on beats. So you're in tune. It's like so don't run up, okay? Because if you run up, I guarantee you ain't gonna leave looking done up. Okay, kind of energy. So, what? Uh, damn, Libra. <laughs> All right, that that was enough. That message right there from that that in particular song, that part right there. That's what it is. That's why you knew. Yeah, you got too much to lose, right? You knew about this demon. One in five is that devil card. You knew about what they did here, even though they tried to hide it. Five, something changed. Eleven, okay. So the coming of winter here. All right, uh, I feel like somebody was definitely something is being iced out, or somebody is is messed up. So something may come back around to them around Halloween as well. Yeah, because whoever you, they had you on they altar here, apples and shit, trying to do like somebody really tried you, Libra. Hmm. Let's get some cards out here. Yeah. 
But something has happened. You sent that damn demon back to the depths of hell where it came, okay? All right, so uh, how did you tap into that energy? They want to know how did you know how to exercise demons? How do you know that? Well, because you who you are. How did you how did you eclipse this? Somebody is now asking too many fucking questions. They need to realize who your ancestors are. You have very powerful ancestors. That's what they all they need to know. They need to remember that. Remember, right? Remember it. Somebody needs to remember. That's why you was able to eclipse that out. Wow. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Your path is clear. This is the journey. You're going the right way. Yeah. Natural spirits. And you have natural spirits on this journey. That is going to always, whatever is hidden in the dark, it's, it's lit up. Your path is lit up. I don't give a, they don't give a damn about what no type of fog around. See all the fog around? You see all these lights? Huh, they lighting that shit up, okay? For you. You gonna always see everything, okay? Yeah. I'm hearing enough was enough for your ancestors. They said that was it. Mm -mm, I never got to go this way. So there's some unexpected endings. So they like, what the fuck? This person is trying to figure it out right now, y'all. Yeah. Now, will they figure it out? I don't know. Where in the heck is my... In particular, deck I'm wanting to use is right here. Yeah, somebody don't know what to do now. Because I, I, I see my deck, but it's like they don't see something. They can't see anymore. Yeah, something was fake. So you already knew somebody's romantic love offer was fake. It's like, yawns. Okay. Like, I'm going this way. Okay. <laughs> they see it now. They're like, damn. All right. That ain't going to work. So Libra, let's see. Yeah. They ain't feelings though. You see things from a higher perspective. You see things higher than them so that you they can't see what you see. Yeah. They're being blocked. They are all in their feelings because they're blocked from your energy. They can't see no more. You may have transitioned to the uh like a higher dimension. That was the missing piece for them. Yeah, they was missing a major piece of this puzzle about who you are, Libra. Mmm. Let's see, my Libras. Yeah, clearing your space here. Yeah, the missing piece. They didn't know that you knew how to clear your space. They didn't know that you knew how to clear some energy out of your space. I see here, spirit. What else? <laughs> the missing piece came out. Phase ended. You ended something. You eclipsed something out that they've been working on for a very long time is what I heard. Yeah, performer. The missing piece is you are in the industry. You're in the entertainment business. You're a performer. All right. Yeah, you got the job. That's why they. That's why God chose you. Whoever you are, you're right on beat. Like I said, you heard that song? That whip, whip, that roll by Libra. I'm telling you, rewind that part. Listen to that part. That's the message from your ancestors, your spirit guides, and who you are. All right. I'm trying to figure out the words to that part so I can give it to y'all. Hmm. Yeah, this toxic family is at their breaking point. They so codependent on you. This could be your family that put these people up to this. They codependent on you because you're the only one that's tapped in. You're the only one that's in the industry. You're the only one. They're going from your space now. A toxic family dynamic is that they, they whole family. Yeah, because you are destined to be this energy, pure energy, clarity, diamonds, because I'm hearing diamonds. Um, something he said, I don't got something to prove. Yeah, I'm young, but I got something to lose. Something I paid all my dues. So you paid all your dues in life. No extortion. You talking about literally? You be walking on beats. Do you hear? Are you hearing me? So, 
you walk on beat. So you're on your path, journey. So some even though it's like it's like somebody need to understand that your 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 life is already orchestrated. You have this pure energy here and you're very inspirational. Somebody was like they they definitely was um jumping to conclusions they was gonna get a level up if they had some sort of did some sexual magic or whatever. Child, mm-mm. That shit did not work. So this toxic family dynamic, this could be their family they work with, your family that put them up to this. But you're definitely about to be famous or you are famous. You're a, you're a star. Yeah. That's why I picked this deck up. You're a star. Libra, if you're not already and this distorted masculine wanted in. Yeah. You could have turned this person down. They had a hidden agenda. Somebody that wears suits and ties or something like that. Yeah, they thought they was out of the way or off the grid. This is definitely somebody off the grid here. Yeah. That won't, they won't even talk to you if you don't get the money. Let's see. What's the toxic family here saying here doing what? Somebody talk. This was their family here. Yeah, they are not chilling. Yeah, because they are not getting no money and they stressed out. They're not getting no more money. They're not getting any of your money or any of that. It's protected. Somebody's not paying them any more money. Yeah, look. Somebody is in feeling mentally entrapped because they thought you was going to be more than friends with a slacker. <laughs> they're crying. Yeah. Because their projection. All right. Yeah. Ooh, 12th house, baby. Yeah. So they that shit didn't work. They tried to use your 12th house, your own undoing on you. Your hidden talents, your secrets, your dreams. One has okay. So this these people, your weaknesses. Somebody definitely is about to receive karma. They crying right now. Cause this stalking energy is going to be in a reverse here. Yeah, they're losing their stability. This copycat can't copy you. They salty. So also the projection was we're just alike. No, in your heart, no, we're not. So somebody ever say that to you? We're the same. They're trying to Feed into your energy. Cut it. Block it. Before you do anything, always block. Protect your energy before you do anything. That's how projections backfire. All right. Somebody was trying to project something to you. Industry energy. They want to be in the industry too. We got a performer here. Always partying. They're a spiritual hater. Somebody definitely said that you was always partying because you're in the industry. Balling. This person is definitely not balling due to their toxic connections and they don't have a lot of confidence. I feel like they didn't have all the information. Somebody was just lying, telling them that they could uh steal the, steal your energy or take everything you got. 1818. 18. Like, no, the fuck? <laughs> missing peace. This person is missing peace of spirit. Yeah, you don't these low vibrational people have his hidden agendas. That was the missing piece here. They had no limits of how far they would go. All right. Like also like what I'm noticing um, when people are doing love spells, especially with me, they always try to go into my dream state. That shit just makes you look so suspect. I already know it's you. And then they always say the same fucking thing. It's like, do y'all only read from the same books? Like these like things, these projections that these people are trying to do are so old and they will not work on a divine being at all. Right? Your path is clear. Somebody was trying to block that. It's clear. This stalking energy is clipsed out. Don't worry about it. Forget about it. That's what I'm hearing. <laughs> Forget about it. Yeah. Somebody about to divorce somebody here. Energy drainer. Or somebody about to stop dealing with this person. Working with this person. They are intimidated. You don't deal with energy drainers. You don't deal with low vibrational people. That was the missing piece. And you already knew they had an agenda. You picked up on it. <laughs> the finesse tactic. That smooth talker. That love bomber energy. It's one-sided. Somebody realizing that they can't finesse you. 
It's a one-sided love. So whatever love bombing or feelings they was feeling, they only feeling that shit. You not clearing your energy and your space, Libra. I feel like you cleared your energy here of this person or these people. Okay? Try and play you. Okay? Yeah. Have receipts. So somebody got receipts. You cleared your energy. Yeah. And you ain't coming back. <laughs> So these family members are trying to get you to come back or whatever, or these lovers or whatever. Yeah, no. You don't want to be friends. You don't want to be family. You don't want to be none of that shit. They can stay over there. All right. And whoever this high priest is realizing like something is over for them now, this leader of a cult, this mature male at a distance. Yep. Karma. Right. Because I mean, you come into a Libra like this, you, what else do you expect to get? It's karma, sweetheart. Especially somebody that's in there and they're on their right path. That's karma for even trying to play in somebody's energy like that. You don't do that. Yeah, they pissed the fuck off. 10th house. Because they were so sure that 12th house energy was going to work. They saw it. All right? They saw it. It says the situation involves someone's ambition. You're ranking. They saw it on who you are. Libra. Woo! All right? They saw it, sweetness. Mm-hmm. They mad as shit. They mad shit right now. Whoever this person is. Let's get some cards out here. Somebody definitely was expecting some money from this or money out of this. Could be the earth sign here. Alright. Like whatever love spell with that reconciliation. That shit backfired. Okay. That kind of energy. Okay. Yeah. Higher fence. I feel like you're a spiritual teacher or leader here. Ten yeah. I feel like somebody is happy that they that that didn't work. God is happy that that shit didn't work here. Because you're going to be happy. You're going to be in a happy relationship or a marriage moving forward here. Yeah, Ace of Cups. You're going to meet your true love here is what I'm hearing. All right. Yeah, but do you see she's on this path by herself right now? So you could be alone. You could be single. All right. Because somebody was trying to come rushing in to do something. It didn't work. Yeah, using magic or manipulation here. All right. Somebody could be a Pisces. Um, I'm hearing Pisces rising. So somebody comes off as the illusionist is what I was hearing. All right. You may have met this illusionist. That's what I'm hearing. I see. I mean, damn, you're good. Like somebody don't like that. They like, damn, man, you're good. Five of cups. Like, they never thought you was going to figure this shit out. Mary got to be quicker than that. Y'all funny. What's, what's this? Yeah, page of swords. They know. Secrets. They spying. Yeah, they, they got the message that you knew something. Page of swords. You know exactly who's spying on you. you they know the message. Something about a message. Something about, uh, yeah, period. How's this person uh, planning on coming towards y'all here? Somebody is definitely Aquarius moon, I heard. So somebody can have an Aquarius moon here. Yeah, that was wishful thinking for this uh, water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I feel like they want to apologize. Five of Swords is hopeless, romantic, um, page of cups here. All right, I love news here. Conflict, Five of Swords. They've been defeated for this page of cups energy because something was an illusion. They're heartbroken. you so damn intuitive. You knew to protect yourself from whatever this offer was. Maybe in the past, somebody tried to cause imbalances in secret. Maybe for you didn't see something or whatever they was trying to do. Okay, to you, high priestesses. What's the um, obstacle for this person moving forward, Father? Ace of Wands in the reverse. They will not have a passionate new beginning. They lost something. They, Yeah, regret. Five of Cups. Somebody lost something. Here. Yeah, the higher fin. This is being brought down by the divine. Okay. Yeah, damn. Because this was a the spiritual connection. Ace of Cups. All right. Damn. Somebody wished they would have waited. But they only caused a burden to their happiness. God, definitely justice karma is stepping in here. Somebody wished they would have waited to do something now. They realized they sabotaged something because you knew something. What's the um, outcome of the situation for you, Libra? Moving forward. Ooh. We got, ooh, six of cups in the reverse. You are no longer reconciling with this past life soulmate. There will be no reconciliation. 
Yeah, King and Queen of Swords. Yeah, they are all in their head because you you get to move towards a new beginning. Oh, somebody is hurt right now. That's probably why they pissed off. Okay, yeah. You're getting a gift, Ace of Pentacles. So somebody is very unhappy with something that they did in the past that sabotaged something right now. They were invading your space here. Somebody was invading your energy or something they shouldn't have. This high priest from a distance or whatever. Yeah, that's why they're going to be left out in the cold because they, they something had to be uh, practical. They have to be trustworthy. You don't trust them. So somebody has to be trustworthy or else they don't get in. And they already did a ruse or a projection and they like, oh my God, they can't believe it. What's the page of swords here? It could be a Gemini here, Aquarius. We got a Leo, Aries, Sag or a Scorpio. Let's see. Page of Swords. So somebody is spying here, watching. Eight of Wands online. Was watching online, yeah. I feel like, yeah, they wanted to be with you here. But due to their double energy, they missed an opportunity. Yeah. You go, yeah. I feel like somebody was very jealous or toxic or something. They're definitely um, obsessive as well. Codependent. They can't be around you. What's the Eight of Wands? So somebody was spying on you online or whatever. They regret that now. Yeah, because something is coming to end here or laying the rest here with this water sign. All right. Or they, you don't see them as the king of cups here or something like that. What's the five of uh five of cups here? They have regret. Yeah, they feel foolish here. They should have came off as the king of pentacles. More stable, more mature, they feel like. Somebody feels like that because you had a soul ascension and it was going to be too challenging to try to control you with magic. You had some sort of soul ascension. So they can't control you with magic. Nobody can. What's the five of swords here? Yeah, so they yeah, they only defeated themselves. It was an unwise choice because they brought a tower to themselves and everything that they wanted to invest in. They may have wanted long-term love or relationship or this was long-term love and relationship. But they sabotaged that. What's the tower? Damn. Yeah, seven of pentacles to something. I told you somebody was investing in doing this a long time. So that they can come towards you or move towards you or something can move forward on an investment. Well, seven of pentacles here. Ten of swords is over now. It's an ending. Yeah. Somebody shocked they didn't ever see this. This Pisces. Yeah, they was ready to celebrate something until you seen something in Hermit or in a dream and they were waiting or somebody was secretly watching in secret and was waiting to cause some sort of imbalance. But did you told the truth and they're heartbroken because you're single or abundant or you're mature here. Yeah, you got the message from the higher up here. Yeah, so you got the message from the divine. So God could have put you down or your ancestors put you deep with some information. What's the ace of wands here? And of course, when you are a divinely guided being here, this person hates your spirituality because you're a performer. You're in the you're in the on a platform where everybody looks up to you. They wanted to drain you of that energy. They thought they could finesse you, which is demonic. So this person definitely already is going through. That's why they're getting karma because your justice, your karma. Anybody is either you're in somebody's life as a lesson for them or a blessing for them. You know that. Ace of Wands in the reverse. So there will be no passionate new beginning here for somebody here. Yeah, damn. Ten of Pentacles. Somebody is not happy because you are the Ten of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, and they was trying to lie to you. That's where they fucked up at. You already knew the truth, Ten of Pentacles. Oh, man. Yeah, this family lied to them. So somebody lied. Somebody family lied to them or did you lie? They lied to their family about you or something, child. What's the Ten of Pentacles here? Because they was expecting something to move forward. Yeah, it was time. They thought something was going to go in their favor. This Virgo, Aquarius, whatever. Somebody really thought something was going to go in their favor. All right. Maybe Mercury energy with some communication. Eight of swords. But honey, they are stuck now. Because you recognize something. Triumph. Yeah, they about to be left out in the cold here. We got the Emperor. Okay. Ooh. King of Pentacles, whoever this older gentleman is, sees that you had a soul ascension and you're standing your ground here. I feel like uh, somebody is restless here because they know you're about to walk away and everything is about to come to an end. 
and you're going to heal your two of cups situation. So somebody's like, damn. So this person was trying to play false twin or trying to play like they were supposed to be with you or whatever this is. Like, no. All right. This is a past life situation. That's not happy. It's not conducive. This is definitely somebody wanting you for money or something like that. Collective. What is the six of uh, cups in the reverse here? Yeah, they are not happy because that manipulation only they fucked up. Yeah, you can't do that. Look. Hopeless romantic empress. Yeah, you already knew the truth. You knew what's up. The cycle is over with that energy. So somebody is not happy about this magic they did on you in the past, Empress. Yeah, because you was too fucking strong. What's that strength card? Yeah. Yeah. And I feel like your work, your ancestors or your spirit guides is way stronger. You work for God with the higher fin. Somebody might want to apologize here because they know something is coming to an end now. Right? You definitely did the right thing because you mastered yourself. You're a master now. It's the Eight of Pentacles here. Alright, yeah. Four of Wands. Period. Damn. High Priestess. Somebody knows this or you know that. Yeah, they know you are Empress. Hmm. Yeah, man. Whatever options or somebody causing imbalances, judgment got called on anybody trying to cause conflict to your confidence as well because maybe they thought they can hit you where it hurts. When it has something to do with your confidence, child. Mm -mm -mm. Or what you already know, right? So if somebody tried to challenge what you know, that's where they fucked up at. Yeah, we got a spiritual high priestess three years ago. So somebody could be doing this for three years. Yeah, under the new moon, the dark moon here, a Sagittarius. All right. It says, I'm single. They could have hired a witch doctor here. Now they all in their head and their feelings on Monday. About this karmic woman here maybe all right they feel bad for what they did here this weekend as well yeah maybe you were supposed to get some sort of true love offer this weekend that passed or whatever okay i don't know but there's a karmic woman here witch doctor we got a sagittarius new moon energy high priest all right so somebody definitely did some work on you trying to get something or did some work on this Sagittarius, or if you're the Sagittarius, or however. All right, let's see. Yeah, she big mad. Oh, love, because you're connected to the all. Okay, all that is and all that will ever be. M N O R P Wednesday. <clears throat> yeah, they wanted power over you, but no, they got to make it up. Something has to be made up to you this lifetime because you're on your journey. You're on your path to light. And she big mad here Friday because, yes, they lied to you about everything. But you learned it's a lesson. You get to let it go here. All right, Libra. A, B, C, and D. First, last, middle, initial. Three, three, three. You are powerfully aligned with Jesus and other ascended masters at this time. And you're about to remove, be moved from all previous setbacks. I'm telling you, these people going to wish they never did this because they're about to really experience karma for this. Yeah, that hex that they was doing on you. I told you something about this Pisces here last week in a Gemini, a Capricorn. All right. Yeah. Somebody knew you was an empress. Okay. Or someone's empress on the full moon. Yeah. So did they, yeah. Cancer, E, F, G, and H. Why can't they find somebody like you? So somebody was definitely, this could have been your ex's friends or your ex's whoever. Somebody definitely knew you was an empress or you knew, they knew you were somebody's empress. Okay. And they was trying to do some work on you or something like that. Here, I told you they only wanted money a year ago. So something significant could have happened a year ago here. You was the one. Now this person is about to lose you for good. Because this person, toxic family dynamic, put this person up to this. And literally they're about to lose out on everything as well. We got a Pisces. The magic is about to backfire on them times 10. We got a Gemini. Last weekend, they could have did something here. You could have did some sort of cleansing. Something like I said, somebody wasn't alone here. So Thursday, something is over here. She mad as shit. New moon because they're getting karma for whatever they tried to do. And it's going to hurt them really bad in their pockets and everything else. Somebody might even go to jail moving forward with the Eight of Swords. Have a blessed day.